say you've got a presentation to do, why not use Microsoft PowerPoint? Now, with Microsoft PowerPoint, you can also do voiceovers. So, there's specific slides that you need to present and have a voiceover and just record it. This is probably one of the best softwares to do it with. Let me show you. I'm just going to open up a template. I'll go through it quickly with you to get you up and running. Let's use the Fresh Food Presentation template, shall we? And create as multiple slides to work with. I'm going to enable content at the top. Now, you might need to do a voiceover for this presentation. So, what you need to do is cut the top and select Slideshow. Now, don't worry too much about the options here for now. I just want to give you the principle. So, select Record. You can do from beginning if you want as well, or current slide. I'm at the beginning anyway, so I'm just going to click on that option there. And it brings up this window. Now, a couple of things to remember quickly. Bottom right hand corner, choose your view. So I'm leaving it on slide view. So at bottom left hand corner, can you see here, I can change slides as I'm recording. So it will change the voiceover to each slide. At the top is your record button. On the left, you have an edit button here, so you can go back again if you wish. Go back to record and go back to slideshow and record. Also, important, check your microphone you're using. So come to the right and make sure you've got your microphone that you want to use showing there because you'll have a selection there to tick. Using the camera, select that also. Also, when you finish, you've got the export button. So you can actually export that as an MP4 video as well in high definition which is quite handy as well you can even customize the export later here and it brings to this little window so if it's not full hd you need you can choose a different format down to standard if you want as well but no let me show you how it works so i'm going to go again to slideshow and record so obviously you need your content what you're going to say so i'm just going to waffle a bit make some stuff up to show you how this works now to change your slide as you're recording, press the left button on the mouse and that will change the next slide or hit the bottom left hand corner option. So let's give it a go. Welcome to my presentation. Now today I'm gonna to look at healthy eating. How paramount is it to eat healthily? Here's my slide too, see I did a left click on it. I wanna to talk today about fresh fruit and veg and I also want to talk about complex carbohydrates and and how important they are to your health. There you go, now on slide three, I can show the chart, come down and I can even annotate that as I'm recording. So I might make that a yellow, choose a highlighter and then I can highlight stuff and still recording as well, remember. So I can come down, go to slide four, for example, as I'm still recording. Last of all, I can go to the next slide and again, carry on recording and doing a voiceover. So I want to cut the stop. I can pause it if you wish, because you might think what you want to say. You haven't written it down. But I want to stop that, show you how it works. So I'm going to select the stop button. Now, if you need to retake record, if you need to do the recording again, you can use this option here. Because you might just want if I tap on it, just on the current slide or on all slides. So if you made a mistake on that slide, you can then go back over that with your recording. So bear that in mind, because you don't want to keep starting again, do you, from the beginning. Now, I'm going to export it here. So if I click the export first here, I've got an option to give it a name. And it's going to save it as high definition, 1080p as standard. But you might go no custom export, actually, because I, I want to save it as something else. If I click this, you might go, actually, I want it ultra high, 4K. Or maybe I'll just go high definition, 720 and click create choose we're going to save it to so i say that to my downloads folder give it a different name let's call that layout 2 shall we and select export see bottom right hand corner it's now exporting it there that it's done S select it and select yes and click ok my presentation now today I'm going to look at healthy eating. How paramount to change the minute eat, slide. How paramount is it to eat healthily? Here's my slide too. See, I did a left click on it. I want to talk today about fresh fruit and veg, and I also want to talk about complex carbohydrates and and how important they are to your health. There you go. 
I'm going to click escape button. That's me talking now. And pause it. So that's how easy it's to do. Now you've got yourself a voiceover from your lecture slides. If I close that. So it's quite easy to do. If you're not happy with it, just come up the top here. Select the clear recordings. And these little options in the corner will then get rid of the recordings you did with your voiceover. But have a little play with that. Don't forget as well. You can save as a show as well by clicking this. If you just want a PowerPoint show as well as well export into video. And there you go. That's how you do a voiceover and a presentation.